Hey everyone, welcome to our first installment of MTG Oracle. I'm your host, Nick Muhammad. We've got a couple of other videos in the pipeline right now, but we wanted to get this one out right away because it's Ultimate Masters release weekend. Um, in the coming weeks, we're going to be showing you some videos on what to expect at larger events like Grand Prix and best practices at those events and things like that, as well as a bunch more of these unboxing videos. As you can see, it's a freshly sealed booster box. I believe that there's a promotional pack inside plus 24 booster. Check out the comments below for a list of the cards in the set, as well as the press release from Wizards. So without further ado, let's crack open this box and see what we got. All right, you see that? And the box topper right here, right where they said it is. All right, and then these are the various arts. Seems like those are the only three. Vengevine, Karn, and Liliana. Yeah, that's it. Okay. All right. Do you guys think I should open the box topper first or the packs? I, I think I got to start with the box topper. There's only one card in here, so be very careful when you open this not to damage it. I'm going to do it like this. There we go, okay. Oh. oh. Creeping tar pit. Oh. I'll have to get another one. Let's open these packs. Alright, it looks like the foil is in the front on these packs. You get one token. One foil, one rare, one, two, three, and commons, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten commons. Ten, three, one, and one, plus a token. All right. Let's, uh, I'm not going to do that for all of them. I'm only keeping the rares. You know what? I should put this in a sleeve. It's still worth something. All right. All right. Undying Rage. Visions of Beyond. I'm not sure if that's worth anything. All right. Nothing worth anything. Let's try opening this guy. Hold on. Let me fix this box up a little. Ah, okay. Thermo Alchemist. Ooh, that's a nice card. Ooh, love a spike. And I don't think any of that's worth anything. All right. I wonder how much the guard is worth. All right. Yeah, I'm cool. I don't know if that's valuable or not. Ooh, another mythic. One's an okay mythic. Uh, about that. Alright, Zombie, Hissing Iguanar, Sovereigns of Lost Alara. I don't know if that's worth anything. <laughs> Alright. A lot of the same tokens here too. Oh, a new token. Think twice. Ooh, Urborg. Tomb of Yogamoth. Yogamoth. Uh, see that? Okay, holy. Interesting. Is 
Citizen. Canker Abomination. Squeak. Ugh. Garbage. Why is he even in this set? Okay, let's do a couple in succession here. Magic Search. Fauna Shaman. Bunch of trash. Citizen, I don't even know what class that. Arena Athlete, ooh, Fulminator Mage, that's a good one. <laughs> I think this card is going up in value. I don't know which of the commons are valuable, actually. I know some most of the uh, uncommons, though. All right, Elemental Token, Urban Evolution. Ooh, Noble Hierarch, look at that, two for two. Ooh, sleight of hand, that's a valuable card. So that's this one, Young Pyromancer. And then, I don't know about the commons. What are the really valuable cards in this set? I think uh, Liliana. I think that there's... Oh, well, let's see. Foil, Ruined Halo. I don't know if that's valuable. Desperate Ritual. Da, 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 da. All right. How many more do we have? We got four times three, 12. We're halfway through the box. Oh, let me take this opportunity to talk a little about the packs. They look like your standard packs, maybe a little different than what I've seen. This uh, kind of crimping at the top looks a little different. The packs have a certain plasticky feel to them a little bit. Uh, I don't know. They're, they're pretty average. There's like, I don't know, I, not a, like, less give. Ray of Dawnbreaker, I don't know if she's worth anything. I know Chino's a good worth something, though. And Anchor. All right. Let's pick up the pace a little. A Homunculus token, Demir Guild Mage, Golgari Cave Troll. I don't think that's worth anything. Okay, that's a number pack. Again, I don't get a couple of good ones in here. Becca needs a new pair of shoes. Appeal of Darkness, Seismic Assault. Mm. Gonna D's alright. Alright. Worm Token, Fire and Ice, and Spoils of the Vault. I don't think that's worth anything. And. Let's not talk about that. <laughs> Elemental. Turn to mist. Sublime Archangel. I think. I don't know. Uh, yeah, the good one. Come on. I need good mythic. I've been all my good mythics already. Come on, Liliana. Ooh, Tarmogoyf. That's what I want. Thespian stage. Well, I can't get everything in life. Spider, uh, gamble. Um, ooh, boggle. Departed druid. Oh, I have a turn in here. Wait a minute. That was reprinted at uncommon. Interesting. All right. Maelstrom Pulse. That was one of the cards reprinted in the top forty for. Uh, the promo pack. Maybe it's worth something. Alright, come on. Rise from the tides. Tie cigar. Dun, dun, dun. That's it. Hopefully, we get something good. Mammoth Umbra. Through the Breach. I think that's worth something. I'll have to look it up. On burial rights. That's what burial rights would be like. Those are worth something. I don't know. This isn't such a good box. Soul Spire. Ooh, Celestial Fawning. That's worth something. Dun, 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 dun. I'm surprised I haven't gotten any kitchen things.
All right, Spark Elemental, Golgari Char. Wow, I did not get any foil rares in this whole pack. I finally got that kitchen mix I was talking about, though. Well, there you have it. One box of Ultimate Masters.